The average San Diegan consumes nearly 180 gallons of water a day. That's equal to all 36 of these five gallon bottles. You use one bottle every time you flush the toilet. Four to six when you take a shower. Eight if you soak in the tub. Washing dishes takes roughly two bottles. A load of laundry uses five or six. And a leaky faucet can waste two bottles worth of water every hour. And it probably takes 18 bottles to water your lawn. Water consumption in San Diego has almost doubled since 1940. And people use more city water in dry years than rainy ones. But Richard King, head of the city water department, says people are getting the message on conservation. We don't think the drought has ended. And we certainly don't think that uh, what is going on right at the moment is indicative of a, um, of a short uh, problem. We think this is a long-range problem, and we hope that people will not uh, react to this momentary effect we're having of rainfall and uh, start going back to using water again, because this is a major problem that's going to be with us for a long, long time. If in the event, however, that we go through the same type of a drought situation in the early 80s that we're having at the present time, and without having the Colorado supply to back us up, then we indeed are going to be in a very serious problem. And the only way out at the present time is conservation. Most city reservoirs are full. King says the city tries to keep a six-month supply of water on hand in case of emergencies. Lake Murray has been kept low because of hydrilla. The Florida weed used in home aquariums somehow made its way into this city reservoir, and only exposure to air seems to kill it. King says there's no crisis right now and continued conservation could keep one from coming. Jonathan Dunranker reporting for TV8 News.